Remember when I did that one thing where I talked about how awkward I am in school and pretty much in every other social situation? Well, it's back! <laughs> Welcome to That Awkward Kid number two, and today I'm going to be telling you three very near and dear stories to me that happened actually all in one week. <laughs> the first story I'm going to be telling you is about a run-in with this very attractive guy. So I'm at Arby's with my parents, and I walk in, and they walk in with me, and of course our cashier is this pretty attractive person, in my mind at least. So, me being the person I am, I grab out my phone, look down at the screen, and pray that he doesn't try to talk to me besides asking me what my order is. So, pretty much what happened is I walked away as soon as I could because I was completely terrified to actually have human interaction with a person who I think is more attractive than I am. Story number two. I was in school and I was super tired. I didn't get a lot of sleep the night before and I wasn't really thinking about what I was saying when I was saying it. So our teacher is asking us a question and I automatically answer not thinking. The word I was trying to say was stoma, but let's just say that's really not what came out and she gave me a weird look. And my last story. So the reason this is really embarrassing is because it was the day of my job shadow. For those of you who don't have job shadows, it's pretty much when you follow around a person all day to get an idea and a feel of what the job you want to pursue would be like. Right as I was going to leave to get to this job shadow, I was in heels, I was walking down the stairs, and my ankle just gave out on me because I have a bad ankle for some reason. And I fell down the stairs and I landed on my face. So I had to get up like nothing happened, walk into our office at school, and then tell my mom, I fell down the stairs and my ankle hurts really badly right now. So can we go home and get flat shoes. The good thing is nobody actually saw that happen except for maybe my French teacher. So no harm, no foul, right? So if you like this video, make sure to give it a big pause up, comment, subscribe, and all that fun stuff we all love doing. I will be starting my Christmas videos on December 11th and going until the 22nd because I'm doing 12 days of Christmas, I think. So I'm getting that figured out right now, but I just wanted to update you on that. There. Done. We're good. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I love you all with all my heart. And I will see you next time. But until then, I'm out.